Three years ago, on the 18th of March, I made one of the early Life in Jars classics, the Mini Ecosphere. It featured some aquarium grass, copper pots and ostracods. Two weeks later, it turned out that a chironomid larva must have been present in the soil because there was an adult lake fly in a jar. After three months, the aquarium grass was doing very well, but the copper pots had gone extinct. After a year, some aquatic mites appeared, possibly Norwegian water mites. The plants were still doing well, and I told you that the ecosphere was not fully airtight, and that I would do something about it. Being the lazy bum that I am, I didn't. So, this is where we are today. Almost all of the water evaporated out of the jar. It's not completely desiccated by any means, but it is quite dry. Much drier than it looks like on camera. Because this cork just isn't airtight. So I decided to open it up, and then this happened. So I had to do it the proper and cool way. And not even that much cork was lost. While I use this opportunity to clean the glass, let me explain my plan. I am going to fill this little jar with water again, to try and see if life that was previously alive and living in the ecosystem can re-emerge. For instance, dried ostracod eggs that get wet again could start hatching and algae spores could very well be present. If plant and animal life does appear again, we can think about sealing the jar off and creating a closed ecosystem again. There, that's better. If we take a closer look at the dried up soil, we can see some very interesting algae structures, as well as some ostracod remains. I refilled it with some rainwater. Here we can see that the water is slowly penetrating the soil. Five days later, the soil still isn't completely wet yet. Of course, there isn't a very high water pressure. There doesn't appear to be any new plant or animal life in this little jar yet. When looking at it, both from the side and through the microscope, I kept seeing small objects moving. But I think that might just be my brain playing tricks on me. However, as soon as I do actually see something new, I will immediately update you, of course something completely different. It turns out that a lot of you don't want me to drink an ecosphere for the 300,000 subscribers special, for various reasons. This is also fine with me and I was wondering if you might have any other ideas, because I do want to do something special. Well, that's about it for today. Thanks for watching and good ride.